Karen Spencer's new move on Instagram hinted the Sussexes' secret fight as Meg refused to kneel at Diana's grave. Princess Diana's brother's wife, Karen Spencer, caused an outpouring of emotion on Monday morning this week, posting two emotive photos of the late Princess of Wales' resting place on Instagram. The late Princess of Wales was laid to rest on a small island in the ornamental lake known as the Round Oval, which is located within Althorpe Park's gardens. Leading to the oval is a path, which consists of 36 oak trees, marking each year of her life. Originally, Prince William and Prince Harry's mother was meant to get buried in the Spencer family vault. However, the plan was rejected over safety concerns. The round oval, where Princess Diana was laid to rest at Althorpe House, is shrouded in mist in the eerily beautiful photo, with Karen captioning the beautiful photo, the round oval, looking rather magical in the mist this morning. Karen's followers were enraptured by the hauntingly beautiful photos, which were also accompanied by a video of the area. Your husband chose the very best resting place for Diana, a place of beauty and silence, a follower wrote, while another added, the perfect, most beautiful resting place for a princess. Diana was so loved. Others noted that the setting is serene, with a third writing, feels serene and the sunrise looks like a heart shape. It's perfect. Karen was clearly taking an early morning stroll around the grounds, as she also posted a photo of the walkways glittering in frost. One commenter then bluntly asked Karen Spencer if Meghan and Harry had been banned from Althorpe House. Karen mentioned Harry is welcome because he's Diana's son, but she didn't mention Meghan Markle. Another person said below, I heard Harry and his wife had a secret trip to Althorpe House to visit Princess Diana's grave in 2022, before the Queen's funeral. Meghan showed rude behaviour in front of the grave. She even refused to kneel at Diana's graveside as a ritual. Harry was so angry. They had a fight in the car when they travelled to Manchester and Dusseldorf afterwards. Charles Spencer's wife didn't respond to the comment, but she hit the like button. A few months ago, rumour has it that Meghan desired to be formally adopted into the Spencer family. Charles Spencer reportedly declined the proposal, citing concerns that Meghan may exploit the Spencer title for personal financial gain. The controversy surrounding the couple deepens further as Meghan Markle faces allegations of stealing jewellery from the royal family. Meghan has always used Diana to manipulate Harry. She wants to become Diana 2.0 and use Harry's pain over his mother's death to drive a wedge between him and the royal family. In the past, Harry, before marrying Meghan, told Newsweek, My mother had just died and had to walk a long way behind a coffin, surrounded by thousands of people watching me, while millions more did on television. I don't think any child should be asked to do that under any circumstances. I don't think it would happen today. Then, in his memoir Spare, Prince Harry wrote that there was absolutely no way he would have let William walk behind their mother's coffin alone. He said, There's absolutely no way that I would let him do that by himself, and there's absolutely no way that he would let me do that by myself. It was as if it was role reversal. His overbearing wife no doubt told him to say that.